From the Bob Mills Weather Center, the Oklahoma weather expert, David Payne. Well, here's what you do when the heat just really, really cranks up here. That shot from Emily Walsh, and uh, yeah, that's what you do. You put a little bit of wax paper in front of the car, throw some cookie dough in there. You gotta love cookie dough. I, personally, I like it better like this. Then like that, that's just kind of who I am. But look at there, a few minutes in, we're going to this mode. And uh, I, it was funny, I saw the picture. She sent them to me on Twitter and I said, so how'd they turn out? And she goes, hell yeah. And I go, hey, look at there. We got cookies, we got a pool, we're coming over. So Carl, Amanda, we're going to her house. Okay. We're in. After yeah. the show tonight. Sounds like a plan. Thank She's, you, Emily. Thank you, Emily. <laughs> she lives Thanks close. for the invite. Okay, good. She's close, she lives like five blocks from Carl. This is gonna be great, all right. So uh, that's what was going on today. Uh, with Emily. She was just baking cookies. Sure, why not? So there it is again, 110. And this is, again, we'll go down as the hottest July temperature ever in Oklahoma City. It's tied for the hottest. We've done this a couple of times, but not very many. Not very many. As a matter of fact, since 1890, here in Oklahoma City, how many days at 110 degrees? Only seven. Let me say that again. Since 1890, seven days, okay, in, in the entire summer. We've had seven days at 110 degrees. We've had no days at 111. And then in 2011 and uh, 2012, we had a couple of 112s and 113s in there. But uh, yeah, so the heat today is unprecedented. We don't have this type of heat very often. Today makes day 10 at or above 100 degrees. That's our average for the summer. We're already there. And uh, yeah, you've seen the nine day, I know. It's brutal. 113 today in Kingfisher. 110 in Stillwater, 110 in El Reno, 109 in Seminole. And every yellow, again, temperature on this map is a new record high temperature. It runs from Tulsa all the way to Elk City. Look at those high temperatures today. At least 40 record highs, if not close to 50. And this is also something pretty unique. So all these temperatures on here from the Oklahoma Mesonet, right? So today, for the first time ever, all Mesonet stations for the first time ever reported a temperature of 103 and or higher. The Oklahoma Mesonet was unveiled uh, in the mid-90s. Yeah, so it's, it's just saying a lot. Now, let's jump to this. Thunderstorms, a few running from Major County, actually going down towards Hitchcock, where the fire is still smoldering in some hot spots over there tonight. Also, a little bit of lightning and thunder south of Woodward. So there is something going on. At least a little bit of rain. Hey, you folks in uh, Canton, Kent Lake, yeah, enjoy it. So tomorrow, though, here we go again. Talking about an excessive heat warning from Oklahoma City, southwest, south, north, and east. Not as hot in the far northwest because of the front that's going to be moving in. 92 degrees in Oklahoma City. Our humidity right now. 33%. It feels like 91 degrees because our humidity is actually relatively low. It's 99 in Kingfisher right now, 97 in Byers, 90 in Chandler. The rest of Oklahoma, it's 100, 100 right now in Cherokee. It's 96 in Altus, 98 out in Cheyenne. We're still cooking here at 10 o'clock. The heat dome is the dominant factor. We're going to bring this front through late tonight and tomorrow, but man, it's still going to be hot tomorrow, especially long and not ahead of that front. So lows tonight in the 70s and 80s near record warm low temperatures for the night. We're going to take all night to get to 81 in Oklahoma City. Overnight tonight, central, western, northern Oklahoma, slight chance for scattered showers and storms. Tomorrow, the front's going to try to just kind of ooze south. Man, we're cooking. From I-40 north, not as hot as today, but really, 106 in Oklahoma City. The record high tomorrow is another 109. And tomorrow, slight chance for scattered showers and thunderstorms. Tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow evening, some of the data uh, keeping us more clouds and maybe a few more scattered showers and storms around on Thursday. Right now, we'll keep it right at 100, but not as hot into your Friday, but still blazing hot. Low 100s next week, 100s, and then maybe a stronger weather pattern change with rain, maybe some cooler weather by Wednesday and Thursday, maybe of next week. Hopefully, that'll work out. Here we go. Carl, back to you. All right, coming up.